Today's Rodeo Spotlight, sponsored by the Chevrolet Silverado. Well, the San Antonio Stock Show and Rodeo has a big impact on people's lives. From its scholarship program to offering a head start on career paths, it helps kids find their passion through agriculture. In today's Rodeo Spotlight, we're learning about the life of one of those kids, all grown up now, who's heading the Fertilizer Institute in our nation's capital. Corey Rosenbush, welcome. Thanks, Fiona. I appreciate being called a kid again. <laughs> right? I mean, who doesn't? And we're all right. we're all kids at heart, right? So tell us about your history with the San Antonio Stock Show and Rodeo. Well, I have a long history, long before even my scholarship. Uh, I remember very fondly showing my uh, pigs at the San Antonio Livestock Show. So for me growing up, my dad was an ag teacher in a small town near Fort Worth called Glen Rose. So FFA and showing livestock was always just a big part of my upbringing. Now living in uh, Washington, D.C., my kids don't have the same uh, privileges, I will call them, that I did growing up as a kid. And uh, it was family. It's what you did on weekends and it's what you did in your free time and such great, valuable lessons. So is that, is it family and kind of being around that environment, is that what sparked your interest in agriculture? Absolutely. I mean, I, I grew up with it. My dad was an ag teacher. My uncle was an ag teacher. My cousin's an ag teacher. I'm the black sheep of the family that moved to D.C. and is not an ag teacher. So um, just uh, being, being part of agriculture was a big part of my, my upbringing. I did, I did veer away a little bit uh, in terms of my, my last 15 years. I was in the food industry, which, of course, is uh, an important part of agriculture. I ran one of the food industry associations and in about a year year ago, had the opportunity to take the CEO role at the Fertilizer Institute. So our members manufacture any kind of a, a plant nutrient product that helps grow uh, the food that we eat each and every day. You've come so far. <laughs> <laughs> Tell us, of course, how the Rodeo Scholarship Program helped you with your education. Well, without a doubt, I wouldn't be here if it weren't for that that's, that uh, scholarship program. So uh, being the state FFA president, um, it uh, really positioned me to compete for one of the scholarships. And I was fortunate enough to have the San Antonio Livestock Scholarship Program. It allowed me to graduate debt free. Uh, from college. That was back when, when college was a little cheaper. Uh, but uh, that, that scholarship was really instrumental in uh, my studies. I did study agriculture, de agricultural development. That was my undergrad at Texas A&M University. And, um, and of course, the show had a little bit of a unique special part of my life because it's also where I met my wife. Um, as a matter of fact, it was on one of the scholarship uh, programs that I attended that I took a date who eventually became uh, my spouse and mother of my three daughters and we're uh, still married and living here today. So to say that the San Antonio Livestock Show changed my life would be an understatement because it did more than give me a scholarship. It gave me my life and my family. Thank you so much, Corey Rosenbush. We appreciate your time. President and CEO, of course, of the Fertilizer Institute. You can find out more about the San Antonio Stock Show and Rodeo and how to donate to help kids with their education at sarodeo.com.